Hello. Today we're going to do a demonstration on how to do a blood glucose test. Before you start, it's really important that the fingers are clean and dry, and we recommend that you use soap and water to do this. Don't use hand gels or baby wipes. The equipment you need will be a blood glucose machine, a lancing device, and some blood glucose test strips. Your healthcare professional will teach you the exact mechanics of how you use your blood glucose testing equipment. Before you prick the finger, we recommend that you put the blood glucose strip into the machine. Once the strip has gone into the machine, the machine will tell you when it is ready for the drop of blood. Your healthcare professional will teach you how to use your lancing device. Many lancing devices come with depth settings so you can determine how deeply you actually prick the finger. It's important that you use a new lancet before every test that you do. When you prick the finger, we recommend that you use the side of the finger, not the squashy pad, because it's on the squashy pad of the finger that you have most sensation. We also recommend you stay away from the nail as well. You can use any finger to do a blood glucose test or the thumb. When you put the lancet device against the finger, you don't need to press firmly. You just need to make sure that there is good contact between the lancing device and the finger. Once you've lanced the finger, you then need to squeeze the tip to get a drop of blood. and then you apply the drop of blood to the end of the strip. Within about five seconds, the blood glucose reading will be displayed on the machine. It's really important that an adult looks at the screen and you don't rely on the child telling you what the blood glucose reading is. This will mean that as an adult, if you've seen the machine, you will know what is the appropriate course of action to take. Once you've finished doing the blood glucose test, it is important that you dispose of the strip appropriately. Your healthcare professional will guide you on how to do this. You must also dispose of the lancet appropriately as well. And again, your healthcare professional will teach you how to dispose of sharps safely. If you'd like to know any more about doing a blood glucose test, please talk to your local diabetes team.